last time we drove away the Poles from Lviv, at least for now. Um, for how long? <laughs> I have no idea. They will probably be back. They uh, really have a hard on for this town. Right, I will uh, wait here until the siege is over, or actually I will wait until the next morning. So I can get rested while at it. Um, I will uh, reorganize my troops here. <laughs> the Finnish guy is still alive. I cannot believe it. Maybe maybe I should leave him here uh, here at Lviv and let him retire into garrison. Lead the garrison. Lead and train the garrison troops with his... Uh, his experience. He's been with me for quite some time, and I, I remember seeing him, seeing him knocked out many times. But Sarapun has been uh, pulling miracles to keep him alive. Right, I did that, so I can go to the town center and the commander. And uh, there are some troops ready, so I can recruit them like that. Just a sec. They should now be in my army. Yes, excellent. Then we go back there and uh, recruit a new bunch. The, the cost of the cost of the units is is very cheap, but the actual cost is the is the maintenance cost that each each commander requires. Which reminds me, I do have one of them unhired. I want as many troops as possible, so uh, let's appoint the last one, the mercenary captain. Uh, costs 35,000, okay. I'm uh, not getting nearly as much money from Lviv as I hope. I need to need to take take down some towns and really hope Melnitsky gives me gives me a village or two. That's what I'd that's what I'd like to see the most. The Wing Hussar fellow. Let's get him. Let's get the veteran marksman. Uh, I guess I will take the Finnish guy. Yeah, he wants to die in the battlefield, not uh, not sitting in some castle. You guys, you, <coughs> the armored Cossack can come, infantryman veteran, who are actually marksmen, even though their name says otherwise, mm, more marksmen, So we'll take the Watchman and the Diuras, the Rankasa can come, the Bike Watchman can come. Let's take all the Serduks and uh, fill up with infantrymen. I think that's good. Whole lot of, whole lot of firepower in the Cossack army, but uh, not very much uh, protection. Very, very light armored, everyone. Do I have food? Yes, I do. Um, is there a ransom broker in town? Tepes is here. That's interesting. No ransom broker, okay. There's one lord there joining me. Another one coming this way, thinking about it. Now he's going away. Uh, hey dude, come with me. And you don't go anywhere. Ah, oh, there 
it comes to maintenance costs. You are already following me, so why, why leave? Now I rode all the way to here. There was some guy in here. Where did he go? He had a big army. I should have stopped him. Go to bar. Oh man, I need some money. I need I need to raid a Polish village. Oh come on, stay with me. This is hard enough already. Can you please stay with me? Three lords following me, and all this, all this uh, time I use here, getting them to join me. This is all, all, all time that the bulls have, uh, bulls have time to uh, regroup and uh, regroup and come with, uh, come kill us again. Since uh, some of them will leave anyway, I will just take every one I can find. The army chief, man. What? Not possible at the moment, come on! Okay. <laughs> what the heck was that about? The six lords following me. I will ask you as well, even that you have a small army. Even that I have uh, seven of them with me now, when I start a siege I'm expecting only three of them to stick. <laughs> that's, the, that's the way it seems to be. Oh, look at this. Our company commander Les Kritchenko fighting a bowl. Might need some help, so let's do it. Help the man, please. Nine hundred and forty of us in total. Um, I don't want to join that fight on the field. Will I go in and order my men to join? I guess I will. This will usually mean casualties, uh, but not too bad. Eleven of us and the rest of them. Fortunately, he escaped. He had a quite a quite highly trained army. And yeah, I uh, I need to raid a village. Oh wow! That was... Uh, that was lucky. Mamai just got himself an armor. A crude chain armor. Very nice. Okay, well that that alone made it worth it <laughs> to join that uh, join that one. Very rich village. Don't mind if I do. And so many of them are going already. Actually, while I'm here. Why don't you go and uh, raid the village of Snovsk? You don't want to do that. Okay. Do you want to do it? You don't want to do it. Fine. 
They both leave. Great. Oh man. That's that long it lasted that they were actually following me. Okay, someone comes back. Very rich village and what I get? 200. No, 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 that should be enough. Um, now let's, let's ride towards, towards Varsova and Vilna. Sell these, oh. ah, yes, this is, this is so easy. This is so easy that I don't, I don't need any help. And why I'm going here when there's a bridge here, I don't know. Yeah, this is so easy that uh, it's okay that you don't follow me. Why can't you stay with me and why the heck aren't you getting any troops, king? Oh. This is like an... This is like an uphill battle all the time, like, oh, Salt with me. Um, sell some of the extras here. I think two each for these foods will do. With this money, I can live for a while again. What did? Ah, two dollars over. That's fine. Yeah, of, of course they are the lords with the least amount of men. Yeah, but what the heck is wrong with this uh, Melnitsky? Can I get you to patrol somewhere so you get yourself killed? Can I ask you to make peace with the Swedes? Blue patrol around Lviv? No. Um. We have 16 armies and they have 8. That's good to know, but if only those 16 armies would follow me! Can't uh, can't give him an idea that. How about? Me? There he goes. I hope he gets butchered by bandits. Not that I have anything against him, but uh, I want him to respawn and gain some troops. That is, uh, he's been like that for a long time. He was on 16 troops and uh, then uh, lost some troops when he was with me, and he hasn't gained any troops. So that's four lords. I will visit Lviv since I did that round and uh, I will go around to Warsaw. I 
are still recruiting, okay. One more beer. Let's get some powder, I can sell it at some moment when I remember. Right, but you were actually the reason I came here, I remember seeing you here. Can you uh, please follow me? Oh, come on, what the hell? It's like, just just on that moment, AI is deciding something and then uh, it cannot, uh, cannot do anything else. If all these five would stay with me, two armies are quite small, but if these guys stayed with me, Sparat's fortress, and two guys leave. This is getting so incredibly annoying. <sighs> is it because the campaign has been going on for so long? Or what the hell is going on in here? The situation is such that even even the headquarters clerk needs to join this war now. Care to join me? It it won't be long when uh, Sparrow's fortress no longer a siege. It won't be it won't be long when we are no longer winning this war. If you lazy bastards don't uh, don't come and join the war, I can't do it by myself, you know. It's like a me. This uh, at times this uh, this makes this game almost it's 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 not fun. It's grind. It's grind because I have to have to be here getting these getting these men together. They know their orders. Their orders is to follow me at all times if they don't have if they if they are alive. And uh, I should I should cut their heads off for leaving. That should teach them and anyone else who thinks about leaving the campaign. I'm, I'm using I'm using an hour or half an hour or something here just to chase these guys down, so I can have a uh, two or three men to my siege. Right, and rent over because if this guy follows me, everything will be splendid, and he does. He was following me already. Never mind. Good. Now that's what I like to see. Where have you been with your uh, humongous army? I'm still not going to try um, Tsernikov though. Some of them leave again. It can't be. It can't be because they lose sight. Because some of these fellows are still on me. And Lviv has been besieged. Should I even go there? Is that the whole Polish forces? I would really like to see the similar notifications we had in Warband, like great host of enemies, army of enemies, small band of enemies, so I, I'd know. Do I need to go there, or is it okay? Any any other fortress, any other town, I wouldn't go. But Lviv, I don't want to lose it. It's a uh, the game game doesn't know that it's Carl's fortress. The game doesn't care. But uh, 
sure the hell, hell seems that they do. Okay, Poles, get the fuck away from my castle. I can't catch you. And somebody please engage. Poles. He's running away from someone's party. What the hell? 145. Why are you afraid of it? Well, of course you have it. you have the numbers, but you don't have much else. <sighs> this is getting really, really annoying. That guy. That guy is the lead. <sighs> okay, how how many will I get with me if I do this now? Because if the, if the poles have on equal numbers, they will absolutely slaughter us with their uh, winged hussars and all. Then, then winged hussars will take 50 of my men out, and that's that's as simple as it is. So that's that's 450 of them, and my guys are running away. Somehow, some way, I uh, should catch them. I think they will go back to Sparats now. He engages. Now that's that makes things interesting. <sighs> Why are you running away? Son of a You sure are accompanying me.
so many of them. Three fifty, four fifty. They have the numbers. Retreated to a camp. Of course. I won't go. I will just order everyone to go. I hate the camp fights. The A AI on the AI on the battlefield is so idiotic that it's uh, it's just annoying. Annoying to do the fights. The cavalry cavalry could jump over to jump over to cart cart camp, but they never do. And I'm using a shitload of food for chasing the poles down here. All this time I'm not I'm not uh, not seizing anything. Well, they are not in Lviv now, so that's what I'll do. Hopefully, I'll get everyone to follow me. Okay. Oh, great, they have everyone here. Perfect. The king is here. No one else is here. Did they take the sparrows? Well, they are, are keeping it under siege. Okay, let's do this. Fighting a Swedish caravan, great. It. They are too strong, of course, because that is enough time for at least three of these guys to leave. <laughs> 